Hello, welcome to this video. This one is a requested question from May, June 2005, question number six of paper two. Now, it says read these instructions. So A is choose two different numbers from this list of one until nine. Now part B, write down the larger two digit number which can be formed from these two digits, okay? Now write down two smaller two digit number which can be formed from these chosen digits. Part D, subtract the smaller number from the larger number and note the result. So for example, here you can see part A, choose two numbers, which is two and eight. Part B, let's make a two digit number. So the larger will be 82 and the smaller will be 28. Right, makes sense. Now part D, subtract, that will be 82 minus 28, that will give you 54. That is example. Now part A, now we have to do this one. Let's say we have 3, 7. Let's say we do A here. So we have 3, 7. Now we have to follow the instructions. So the first one is we have to write the larger is what? It will be 73 and the smaller is 37. So we have to minus to find the result. 73 minus 37, that should give you 36. Your answer for part one will be 36. Now for part B, you will have choose three other pairs of numbers and follow the instructions. So let's choose other numbers. Let's say I choose one and I choose, um, let me choose um, eight. I choose two, I will choose six, and I will choose five, I will choose nine. And these are random selections. It can be any numbers, you can choose anything you want to as well. So for this first one, it can be larger will be 81, smaller will be 18. So 81 minus 18, that will be 63. Here we have 62 minus 26, so 62 minus 26, that will be 36. Now, now we have be 95 minus 59. That should be 36 as well. And the result is this, this, and this, as you can see. And it says, part C, what do you notice about all these results? So if you see, we have 36, 6, and 63. So what is this? This is 9 times 7. This is 9 times 4. And this is 9 times 4 as well. well. This is 9 times 6. It seems that we have 9, 9, 9, 9. It means that it is, the results are multiple, multiples of 9. So that is one of the observations that you can have. Now for point D, now this is uh, interesting. Uh, the digits X and Y, where X is more than Y, are chosen. Okay, so now we have x and y, where x is more, we can say bigger than, than y. Right. Now part one, find the expression in terms of x and y for this first one, for the larger number. So larger number is pretty easy. It will be, since x is more, x has to be in front, so we have to do 10x plus y. Now the reason why we do 10x, for example, let's say we had two numbers, let's say we had, uh, we had um, 6 and then we had 5. So you want, I think you want to have 65. But now if you were to write 6 plus 5, that will give you 11, which is not what you want. So to make this become 65, you have to do 6 times 10 plus 5 to make it. 65. So same way here we have to do x times 10 plus y to become a two-digit number. So that's the first answer. Now for part two, we have to find the result. So now we have to find the result, which is also we have to find the smaller number. So smaller will be 10y plus x. So same way, if you want to find 56, you have to do first one is 5 times 10 plus 6. Same, same way. Now the result is the larger number minus the smaller number. So large is the first one minus the, the smaller number. So your answer will be 
10x plus y minus 10y plus x. That will be your answer for part two. And this is that question. So as always, if you guys have any other questions, leave a comment down below. I will get back to you guys. As always, thank you for watching. I will see you soon.